this video I'll be flashing these HLW XXD30 MPSCs, uh, very cheap PSCs. They cost about four, four or five euros each. And this is what they are. This red board with yellow heat shrink. This is a Atmel uh, microchip. And what I'm doing here is I'm using a USB ASP clone to flash them with uh, Simon K. Simon K TGI version uh, 1904-2015 by Simon Kirby. And uh, I'll be using this for a a drone on building a multi-rotor exocopter and uh, so this is uh, the ESC basically what you do is you touch with this upon the microchip and then you just flash it. I'll show you this one's done so I, I have this one completely open and it's flashed already so I'll flash a new one and show you how it is uh, in these ones I'll not open the ESC completely I'll not remove the heat shrink completely I'll simply open this is where the microchip is so what I'll do simply is I'll open Here around very carefully. I'll lift the like this small window on the heat shrink. Okay, and uh, now that let me open it a bit more. Now that I that I have it open like this, I have the chip here. I don't know if you can see there's a dot here. That dot has to align with this side of the AVR connector which has a red dot and I put a black line. So what I do is very simple. I have here my power supply regulator. It's connected to a 3S battery. I'll simply, let me get this one out of the way because this one is done. So, I will simply apply power to the ESC. I'll connect red on red and black on black. And then, let me connect this here. Okay, now I have power on the ESC. Lift this up and uh, hold it in place over the microchip. Now I'm gonna go to KK Multicopter Flash Tool and I've already chosen TGI. I'll simply connect the green button to flash and it says it gave an error. Probably I'm not holding it correctly upon the chip. Let me try again. Mm, nope, this time is not working. I'm not sure if I have it. Properly connected. This might get tricky. I'm holding this in place, simply hit flash and as you can see there it is flashing and now it says flashing of firmware was successful just disconnect it 
and uh, you have a flash TSC flashed Simon K. Now I'll cover this with some some tape. And there you go. This one's ready for the multi-copter. Okay, that's how you flash ESCs with one of these using power. If you don't plug power, you cannot connect them to the PC. PC will say it does not find the device. Oh. Cool.